Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is episode 45 of Ocean Block. I'm so excited. <laughs> uh, I love the smog pack. It's so amazing. Um, anyway, let's get right into it. We're gonna go over uh, what I did in between episodes, and we're rough. we're gonna do a seed from mystical agriculture. I'm working on it right now, and we're gonna go see how the Wither Builder is doing. Uh, I just unloaded it. <laughs> I got all this stuff, uh, but it's it does have a few quirks. Like um, when I put the stuff in, it it immediately builds one. It starts summoning it, and then as soon as it uh, materializes it starts building a new one and then uh, it blows up and it destroys it and then uh, my little hopper down here keeps picking up a whole bunch of stuff that's where all my stuff went last time uh, so let's check and see oh I got nine more nice that's pretty nice so I just throw this stuff in there and then leave because <laughs> I don't want to hear it. It's too loud. I think there's a way you could muffle that. Um, there. Uh, entity wither. did not um, help at all. Oh look, I got a fairy going after it. Get him! <laughs> Get him! He's gone. Anyway, <laughs> it's doing okay except for that. It, it's a little bit wonky because I think some of the blocks actually get destroyed. Um, anyway, got a lot of nether stars now that's uh a lot faster than um if, if i were to grow it and i have four seeds oops we got one slime jar there um i think this is just a tier two so i only need What? Why can't I do the thing? We just need... Ugh! Stuff is going crazy. I thought I got a key stuck or something. There we go. And a seed. Uh, it's gonna have to be a solium base. I always forget about that until I get up there. Use boop boop solium base. I don't know how long this takes to fill up the jars. Oh yeah, it's still going. It takes 24 slime balls per jar. Because they only do a half. So that's going to take it a bit. Um, I guess we could try to do a couple little quests while we're waiting. Uh, like in, in miscellaneous. Like what is this? Universal pipe. Pipes don't transfer anything if they are not set to extract. Yeah. You can sneak and click. I know that. A 
Okay, that's like the same message I think that you get in all of the pipes. Yeah. So that's not anything different. Um, I don't think I have very pipes. Also, yes, I do. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. And let's use this guy as well for another quest. Ultimate. Is it called the ultimate pipe? I don't see it. A lot of it's gray. Let's look under pipe. There it is. Universal pipe, not ultimate. There we go. Universal pipe. And we can use this to make this. Sweet, that was easy. Um, I wonder what that does to the pipe. Let's go check on our guy now. Yay! And we should be able to throw those in, put that jar in there, um, and then I think there's like another pretty easy quest in here. We can do this infinity one because it takes just a nether star. Infinity Wand. There we go. I don't really use the wands that much. I don't know why. <laughs> I guess I should try to occasionally, but I don't know. Uh, what else can we do real quick? We can probably do these building gadgets. Uh, yeah, that looks pretty simple. So does that. And we got this one from a quest. So let's do that. Bada bing, bada boom. Bada bing, bada boom. Uh, and one more. Bada bing, bada boom. And they're all filling up with energy automatically. watch a video to learn how to <laughs> to use it awesome one more jar then we can make that seed okay we got that done let's turn in some of these we've got the ultimate pipe upgrade an infinity backpack oh no Two million RF. I don't know, what does it do? Um, charging enabled. Let's look, is there 
Um, is there control for that? going. What happens if I let it fill up? Looks like it only holds 80 million RF. I don't know. sucks up more items or more power and upgrades itself can now can hold a million items that's crazy is it have like a backpack cool but I don't know how to work it uh, let's see what do we get for our pipes uh, waken draconium ingot nice isn't that also a quest uh, the building gadget another mob crusher <laughs> nice iron helmet with a probe and eh. a diamond paxel like my supreme one and an incense altar. Uh, sweet, we knocked out a bunch of quests. Uh, and we're going to make this seed. Because this is. Oh, that gave us 32 awakened draconium? What? That is nice. Alright, let's make this guy. Solium base or poor prudentium. Um, wheedling him down. There's not that many in the second tier left that I need to make. I think there's turtle, uh, honey, the mystical agriculture one, just because I haven't started that yet. There we go, slime seeds. Now we got another quest. A Prudentium broad axe head. No thank you. I have a little place for it though. Let's see how many this is gonna hold. Oh, it's already got one in there. I'm gonna throw these up here. Although that mob crusher. I don't know what I need it for though. I already got a mob system set up. Set. It's been so long since I've been up here. <laughs> oh, we might as well sleep. Slimy boy in the chest because I don't really I don't really need it. I had slimes like uh, almost full of a thousand and twenty-four stack limit. It's got a thousand thirteen, so I'm doing good on slime. Slime is okay. Um if I should put this awakened code in the system. 
So I might forget that I have it. Isn't there a quest for that? Or is it locked? Oh, it's locked behind until you can make it yourself. because I remember you being able to have creative flight when you had a full set of this but I think it was uh, an augment uh, these are from mystical agriculture too and I've looked through them and I could not find uh, creative flight or flight called uh, Pathing AOE augment uh, speed. It's all kinds of good stuff, though. Um, I might have to look into that because I don't remember exactly how to augment. No fall damage is, would be nice because uh, I take a lot of fall damage from the <laughs> from the jetpack. Step assist, jump boost, fire resist. I'd like to have the fire resist. Water breathing, night vision. Yeah, I don't see it. I've looked through it several times just in case I missed something, but. I wonder, does it say, shows you how to make the unattuned pattern, and then, like, say I want, uh, hmm, I want the fire resist. I wonder if you need to put this like on. Let's do the no fall damage. Look at all this stuff. Tertium, unattuned, some wool. Of course you need wool to make you stop taking damage. <laughs> it makes perfect sense. Looks like it's in infusion crafting, but it doesn't. How do you actually infuse that onto the armor? I don't know. I don't know. So. episode here we got uh we got our slime seed done we got some quests done uh we checked in on our wither builder let's go let's go look and see what he's done first yeah still got a little bit left still got a little bit left in there we got four more nether stars nice <laughs> it just keeps rolling in. I have it uh, producing uh, soul sand. It's just constantly cranking it out so we can turn soul sand and heads into <laughs> into uh, nether stars. 
How much are we up to now? 119. I think we're good for now. I could probably stop feeding that thing until I need some more. And find a way to use them. I might, in between episodes, look into... Uh, because it'll just be sitting there looking at the screen. Uh, the... Oh, what was it called? It's in power. Mm. Oh, the nitro crystal. That's what I was trying to think of. Because we still, even if we make the the essence, which I will, we'll still have to add nether stars to it uh, to produce nitro crystals. Uh, but it does take quite a bit of stuff and 20 million FE. Um, I might need to add a couple of um, energizing rods, maybe even some upgraded ones uh, to help speed that along because I don't, uh, I'm only at the blazing tier so that's the nitro so it'll probably take a long time. Anyway, <laughs> thank you for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye bye!